These are the original documents, uh, some of them dating back into the 16 and late 1700s. Soon, people will be digging into those historic papers. They are actually reading these documents and learning to transcribe them. It's all part of a workshop series organized by Keene State to make primary documents more accessible to people who want to read them. They were the, the documents that recorded what was going on at the time that, that the events were happening. Brian Burford is a New Hampshire state archivist. He'll be teaching some of the workshops and thinks transcribing documents is a better way to learn about history. You read about it in the history books. You're reading about someone's interpretation of various scattered facts. Classes are set to take place here at Keene State with a curriculum designed to target an internet-based community. Their transcription and the Word document that is Word searchable will be put up online with the original document so that a person can Word search, zero in on a document, see the original and see a transcription. The National Historic Publications and Records Commission is helping fund the workshops so that the community feels a stronger connection to the past. The more you read these documents, the more you understand that they were human beings just like us. Burford hopes the people taking the classes will realize that. Make the connection between the human experience as it was in the 1600s, the 1700s, the 1800s, and the current time. Helena Batapaglia, NBC 5 News.